My name is Maureen McCutcheon and I come from the parish of Temple Derry in County Tipperary. I'm one of the youth leaders on this year's Kittaloo Pilgrimage to Lourdes. When you tell people that you're going on pilgrimage to Lourdes, it invariably leads to one of the following three requests. Will you say a prayer for me? Would you ever light a candle for me? And will you bring me back a drop of Lourdes water? Or indeed you may get all three of these requests together. Candles and holy water, the tangible things that remind us of deeper and more meaningful realities, what the church calls sacramentals. Their true value lies not in the things themselves, but rather in the divine that they represent. On her fourth visit to the grotto on the 19th of February, 1858, Bernadette carried a lighted and blessed candle for divine protection and thus began the tradition of carrying candles to the grotto that continues today. Great candelabra in the grotto, rows and rows of burning candles filling the air with the aroma of melted wax, each candle the prayer or plea of an individual, a family, a community, a church. The tiniest of lights can dispel the blackest of darknesses. Long after we have left, these candles will stand in new testimony to us having been there. We may return home, but our candle, our prayer, will continue. During the ninth apparition on February the 25th, Bernadette astonished the hundreds of people who were present by suddenly falling to her knees and digging in the dirt. The lady had told her to dig, and when she did, a spring appeared. A few days later, a woman immersed her injured arm in the water and was miraculously healed. Once word of the healing spread, even more people flocked to the grotto. That spring continues to flow today, filling the baths and the fountains from which we take the water we bring home. Water is one of the fundamental symbols in our faith, for it is by baptism in water that we cross the threshold into the family of faith. Perhaps you can connect with our pilgrimage today by visiting your local church and lighting a candle before the statue of our Blessed Lady. As you enter and leave the church, be sure to bless yourself with the holy water. Give thanks for baptism and the gift of faith. Remember and pray for parents and godparents who brought you to faith. Mm -hmm.